Is it time to buy or sell IonQ stock? In this video, we will explore IonQ in depth. Our initial report was published on our website on Wednesday, the 23rd of October, 2024, and now we are here to provide you with a more comprehensive analysis. Remember to subscribe, hit the like button, and turn on the notification bell to stay informed about our latest analysis. You won't want to miss any critical updates that could influence your investments. Enhance your trading decisions by trying our newly launched AI stock analysis tool powered by GPT-4 at stockinvest.us. Tap into the power of AI and receive free price predictions and in-depth analysis for any one of 25,000 companies worldwide today. Please note that this video is intended for informational purposes only and should not be interpreted as financial advice. Since the 2nd of October in the year 2024, our system has classified IonQ as a hold or accumulate, assigning it a score of 0 0.91. Let's examine the stock's performance during this time frame. During this period, the stock has exceeded our expectations, achieving a gain of 60.22% since we initially recommended purchasing IonQ 16 days ago. This amounts to an average return of 3.76% per day since it was designated as hold or accumulate. The stock is currently situated in the upper segment of a notably wide and robust rising trend in the short term. This situation typically presents an excellent selling opportunity for short-term traders, as a reaction towards the lower segment of the trend is expected. A breakout above the upper trend line at $15.09 would indicate a stronger rate of increase. Analyzing the current three-month trend, it suggests a potential change of approximately 48.44% over the next three months, with possible returns ranging from negative 8.55% to positive 51.93%. Looking at the 12-month trend, it indicates a potential change of negative 23.85% over the coming year with expected returns between negative 74.07% and negative 22.55%. This translates to a projected price range between $3.82 and $11.42 after one year. Our latest daily update for IonQ includes the headline, High Volatility in IonQ Incorporated Stock Price on Wednesday which concluded trading at $14.74. The IonQ incorporated stock price declined by 1.80% on the last trading day, which was Wednesday, the 23rd of October, 2024, dropping from $15.01 to $14.74. During that trading day, the stock exhibited a fluctuation of 14.64%, ranging from a low of $14.07 to a high of $16.13. The price has increased in eight of the last 10 days and has risen by 54.51% over the past two weeks. Additionally, volume rose on the last day by 9 million shares, although this occurred amid decreasing prices. This may serve as an early warning, indicating a slightly elevated risk over the next couple of days. In total, 30 million shares were traded, amounting to approximately $440,350,000. Over the past 52 weeks, the highest stock price reached was $16.13, while the lowest was $6.23. Currently, the price sits 8.62%, or $1.39, below the 52-week high and 58.94%, or $21.16, beneath the all-time high of $35.90, which occurred on November 18, 2021. IonQ Inc. has been in the spotlight recently as its stock closed at $14.79, reflecting a drop of 1.5%, which is steeper than the broader market's decline. This performance indicates some volatility in investor sentiment particularly in the fast-evolving quantum computing sector. Notably, investors are paying close attention to IonQ, suggesting an increasing interest that may stabilize or even lift the stock price in the near term, 
especially as perceptions of quantum technology's potential continue to grow. Adding to this momentum, Dr. Masako Yamada from IonQ will participate in the upcoming Quantum Plus AI Summit in New York City. Her involvement could enhance the company's visibility and underscore its commitment to innovation, potentially driving future interest from both investors and industry partners. Moreover, recent discussions have positioned IonQ as a compelling alternative to tech giants like Microsoft for those seeking exposure to quantum computing. As the technology matures and its applications expand, IonQ could attract more significant investment flows. Additionally, actions from influential investors like Amy Raskin, who has bought into IonQ stock, can act as a bullish signal, potentially attracting other investors looking to follow suit. In the short term, while fluctuations are likely given recent market performance, long-term prospects remain optimistic as quantum computing progresses and continues to disrupt traditional sectors. This ongoing narrative could support sustained interest in IonQ, ultimately influencing its stock price positively over time. Analyst Ratings On Friday, the 11th of October, 2024, it was reported that Zach's Investment Research assigned IonQ a perform rating with a hold recommendation. On Wednesday, the 2nd of October, 2024, it was reported that Needham assigned IonQ a buy rating with a hold recommendation. On Monday, the 12th of August, 2024, it was reported that Benchmark assigned IonQ a buy rating with a hold recommendation. On Thursday, the 8th of August, 2024, it was reported that Needham assigned IonQ a buy rating with a hold recommendation. On Thursday, the 16th of May, 2024, it was reported that Needham assigned IonQ a buy rating with a hold recommendation. Analysts have assigned IonQ stock a general sell rating. They have classified the price to earnings ratio as sell and the price to book ratio as sell. Regarding return on investment, the analysts have rated the stock as a strong sell. The following signals have been identified for IonQ. The IonQ Inc. stock presents buy signals from both short and long-term moving averages, indicating a positive outlook for the stock. Additionally, a general buy signal is noted due to the short-term average being above the long-term average. In the event of downward corrections, there will be some support from the levels of $13.30 and $9.38. A decline below either of these levels will trigger sell signals. Furthermore, a buy signal has emerged from the three-month moving average convergence divergence, or MACD. However, some negative signals have also been observed, which may impact the near short-term trajectory. A sell signal was generated from a pivot top point on Tuesday, the 22nd of October, 2024, and thus far, the stock has decreased by 1.8%. Further declines are anticipated until a new bottom pivot is established. Volume increased alongside falling prices yesterday, which may serve as an early warning. Hence, the stock should be monitored more closely. Here are some other signals you might find interesting. Moving average convergence divergence, buy signal, pivots, sell signal two days ago, Bollinger, buy signal 27 days ago, short-term moving average, sell signal 18 days ago, long-term moving average, buy signal 31 days ago. The relation between the short and long moving averages, buy signal 28 days ago. If we look at the 12-month chart, we see short moving average, buy signal 32 days ago, the long-term moving average, sell signal 22 days ago, the relation between the short and long moving averages, buy signal 17 days ago. Remember to visit our page at stockinvest.us if you want to find more signals. Support, Risk, and Stop Loss for IonQ On the downside, the stock finds support just below today's level from accumulated volume at $13.30 and $12.50. There is an inherent risk when a stock is testing a support level, as a breach of this level may lead to a decline toward the next support. In this instance, IonQ Inc. has support just below today's level at $13.30. If this level is broken, the following support from accumulated volume 
will be at $12.50 and $12.30. This stock may experience significant movement throughout the day, indicating high volatility. With a notably large prediction interval from the Bollinger Band, this stock is classified as very high risk. Over the past day, the stock fluctuated by $2.06 between its high and low points, representing a movement of 14.64%. Over the last week, the stock has exhibited an average daily volatility of 12.17%. Before we dive into the potential trading levels for IonQ, let's quickly cover some essential fundamental data. First, let's discuss the price to earnings ratio, commonly referred to as the PE ratio. This important metric measures a company's current share price in relation to its earnings per share. A negative PE ratio indicates that the company is experiencing negative earnings or is incurring losses. Even well-established companies can face downturns, often due to circumstances beyond their control. However, consistently negative P.E. ratios may suggest a lack of profitability and potential bankruptcy risks. In other news, the next earnings report for the third quarter of 2024 is anticipated on the 6th of November, 2024. Analysts' consensus estimates are set at negative 23 cents. It is important to keep an eye on these figures as they can significantly influence stock prices. Now let's discuss some potential day trading levels for IonQ. In the event of an upward trend, the first resistance level for IonQ is at $14.76. If you do not currently own any shares, it may be wise to wait for this level to be surpassed before considering a purchase. For those who already hold the stock, this could be a strategic point for swing trading. On the downside, IonQ faces its first support level at $13.30. If this support level remains intact, it could serve as a favorable entry point, anticipating a rebound. The combined average rating for IonQ from various analyst sources is classified as a sell. Now let's examine some recent insider trades. On the 16th of October, 2024, Alamedine Rima executed an insider sale of 9,875 of common stock. On the 18th of October, 2024, Alamedine Rima conducted another insider sale of 11,375 shares of common stock. On the 11th of October, 2024, Alamedine Rima sold 716 shares of common stock. On the 14th of October, 2024, Alamedine Rima again sold 9,159 shares of common stock. On the 11th of September 2024, Chapman Peter Hume sold 6,356 shares of common stock. Analyzing the most recent 100 insider trades, we find that the insider power is negative, with a ratio of negative 15.172. Collectively, insiders bought 5,474,307 shares and sold 27,325,516 shares in these 100 trades. Our recommended stop loss is set at $14.31, reflecting a decline of 2.92%. This stock exhibits significant daily fluctuations, resulting in a very high level of risk. The 14-day relative strength index stands at 88, which considerably heightens the risk involved. Additionally, there is a sell signal generated from a pivot top identified one day ago. Is IonQ stock a good buy? IonQ Inc. holds several positive signals, but we still don't find these to be sufficient for a buy recommendation. At this time, it should be considered a hold candidate meaning that you may want to hold or accumulate shares while awaiting further developments. Due to some minor weaknesses in the technical picture, we have downgraded our analysis conclusion for this stock from a strong buy to a hold or accumulate recommendation since our last evaluation. After analyzing the volatility and movements from the last trading day, our systems indicate that the current price is undervalued. For trading on Thursday, the 24th of October, we expect IonQ to open at $0.24 cents and begin trading at $14.98.
we remind you that trading involves a high risk of losing money, and you should consult with a financial advisor before buying or selling any securities. Your investment decisions should not be based solely on the information from stockinvest.us. By using this information, you acknowledge and accept responsibility for your own investment choices. This is our current view of the stock. Do you agree or disagree? Please share your thoughts in the comments below. What is your target for this stock? Remember to like and subscribe. We wish you successful trading and hope you have a beautiful day with warm regards from all of us here at Stock Invest.